can't see it. Sorry, I can't see that. Twenty four seven. Nike, just do it. Original, seven up, Apple. Confidential, boost. Versace, true blood, Prada, extra strength for adults, high power, dark night, level nine, the message, mastermind, top chef, right guard, true religion, monopoly money, jackpot, total control, Rolex, game is on, sweet, pay off, Arab money, Gucci, the recession, MySpace, Starbucks, economic stimulus, worldwide, B12, high end. No stamp, Prada, exclusive, overdose, absolute power, arm and hammer, body cure, true religion, stakeovers, top dog, 100%, black label, victory, next level, right time, empire, the new coming, brown sugar, good times, special blend, Louis Vuitton, heart as a mother, shotgun, no mercy, Haiti, happy hours, taxi service, back on top, war horse, white lightning, YouTube, law and order, bring a friend. Mr. Batman said, would be obliged if I showed my face. I've known him for a long while, a hundred years and counting. First thing you learn, you don't say no to Mr. Batman, because otherwise, you know what I mean, you don't want to wait for the man forever. So here I am. Why don't you come up and see me sometime? Times as they are, I am available. Welcome. Welcome to my night school for the first lesson in the laws of success and failure. The curriculum, as advertised, will focus on war and drugs. I see that the uh, attendance register does not lie. A classroom full of eager faces, most gratifying when one has read one's obituary so many times before, ill-informed and made tedious by repetition. The work of those scribblers of the Enlightenment who wrote me off, said I would belong to that old world that was long gone and of no relevance, redundant in their brave modern world. New world old history. But let me tell you, I have never, never felt so strong, never so relevant, so needed as now. Are there any reporters who've slunk in, and you, my students, write this down now. I've never felt so relevant, so needed, so called upon so called upon and ready. Whereas those preachers of the Enlightenment 
Where are they now? Who is it who is truly relevant in the world of now? Ah, oh, you know the answer. That's why you're here, to learn the lessons of success and failure from the one truly qualified teacher. You can operator, Chris. So this modern world, this world of now, what do I see? I see anguish, I see fear, conflict, suffering, irritation, stress, strain. I look around and I see suffering people all around me. Marks of worry, marks of woe, their faces telling a life story of misery and failure. And I ask myself, why? Why is this? And it's the question you, dear students, should be asking yourselves. Why is this the case? Is it really necessary? Does suffering make you more virtuous? Does it make you into a better person? I think not. That's for pity megalomaniacs only. Instead, I ask myself, are all those folk suffering now? I ask myself, is this really necessary? Does it have to be so? Oh yes, in war there are casualties. But in war, is an element in the order ordained by God. Should not be, perhaps. I was not myself consulted, but that is how the world has been ordained. And that's precisely why you, dear students, are here to face up to and to learn how to live in comfort with this world of, of, that has been ordained. As winners or losers in the war game of life. As I say, not perhaps the one you would have wanted, but suffering, my question is yes, yes, you there with the notebook, yes. Write this down. Whether the casualties of war and life, the losers in the game, those who are surplus to requirements, whether well, they must also suffer. The unknown soldier, the amputee, the share stocker, the amputee and the unknown beggar. Whether well, they must all suffer. Drone readiness complete. Target entering cafe. Al-Qaeda. ISIS horse. Coordinate HXX 218. Yes, life and war in such a jumble, but that's how it is. That's reality. And how could there be winners without losers? Ask yourself this simple question How could there be winners if there were no losers? then does this mean that the losers must suffer, that all there is for them is suffering? No, I say, no, no to sorrow, no to avoidable pain. You're entitled. Losers of the world, you are entitled. You have nothing to lose but your misery. Target, using crude... By rear end and HXX 14. Risk of collateral damage unquantifiable at this stage. Now to business, to learn something useful, which is why you are here after all. Let me introduce you to my assistant for this first lesson, Harold. 
the warrior's honey, a savior, a real heroine. Yes, and that is her given name, given by me in fact, a heroine in the fight against irritation and pain. Is this my gig now? Am I on? Yeah. Well, my story, sure. Uh, not really my style. Like advertising myself, but um, Mr. Batman said it's needed. I need it. And you know, it feels good to be needed now and then. So, no problem. Only don't rush me. No stress. No stress. That's me. Fucking killer, isn't it, these days, stress? I tell you something. I was littered once, legal, laudanum. It was very respectable at one time. Even the straight liners were dabbling. Solicitors, old dames in black lace, anthropologists, the Duke. Know what I mean, and why not? OK, uh, maybe uh, at that time, uh, it was my little sister, Morphine. She's a good girl, Morphine, very caring, and she's always busy. She was official front line, you know, the mud, the artillery, that kind of thing, probably still is for all them civvies hit by ricochet from guns and bad luck. Half a mile of compressed intestines spewing out from their tummies and a leg sliced off. Then she'll be there if you're lucky. But fact is, if I was that civvy with the expelled intestines, I'd be wanting me, me heroin, no fucking question. Different class altogether, more refined and a lot more oomph. I mean, plenty more bash for your euro. And just what you require when you know there's a situation why you might need to chill. Target walking In a north hurry. by northwest. Go for the two guys. I go after them. I want to kill these people. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I'm the quiet type. I don't want Pedestrian any of the drama. To high. I leave that to H my little sister. Screaming peoples, amputations, nothing like that. I'm there for you so you can chill like nothing's got anything to do with you. You know what I'm saying? Nothing, nothing's gonna bother you. Be cool. Comfort in the abattoir. I'm there for you. At ease in the massacre, no problem. Regardless of the situation, quick chill. And so it is. More refined. I was there at her birth, actually, 1874, that was. There was more darkness in the world then. No light pollution, the curse of these electric lights. Gaslight was enough for C.R. Adler, Charles Rowley Adler, as those of us who knew him well called him. Yes, I was there, St. Mary's Teaching Hospital, Paddington, in the London Fog. As he tried and tried and tried again until Eureka, morphine into heroin, with the aid of a little uh, acetic anhydride. Yes, yeah, you with the notebook again, acetic anhydride, it's a chemical, we're not talking monks in the desert here. trace. For the record, they will blow themselves up. Uh, 
now, I'm not a man for boasting. I need to, my work speaks for itself. But I was there at CR's shoulder, giving him encouragement, giving him the, the will to persevere. And then a few years later, I did a stint as a consultant at the Bayer Corporation, and it was me suggested heroin as the brand name. Brilliant. And so heroic, so, so relevant, so apposite, because it's the heroic heroine. And she's there for you. Heroine or horse, as some of her friends call her. You hear that? Ready to give you what you need when the nagging, the neighbours, the bills, the debt, the aggravation is too much for any man or woman to endure. So here she is, waiting for you. The wonder drug she was described as, and rightly so, because with her, the result is guaranteed. Guaranteed. The peace that passeth all understanding. That is beyond understanding that is cool, that is the birth of the cool. Yes, but what do I hear when such peace of mind is on offer? Addiction. All I hear from the no-sayers of the world is addiction, that in the long run you become dependent on this wonderful resource. In the long run, in the long run, you're all dead. You're in pain now. Who has time for the long run? Who has time for such an abstraction when you are suffering in the here and now? Yes, I speak of suffering in the here and now. The here and now. Yes, I speak of you. Yes, you there with one leg and half an arm, betrayed by the civvies, who've left you with a wafer-thin pension, with senile in-laws in a one-room flat with wafer-thin walls. Should not be so. Betrayal of promise, but that's how it is. But why then, in addition, suffer? What did they give you? Antidepressant. Antidepressants for housewives with a wobbly smile. Antidepressants, where's the comfort in them? Sadists to have prescribed such things when heroin, heroin is on offer. Listen to her now, listen to heroin telling you how she has gone through so much to make herself available to you. Listen to her now, listen to her story and appreciate that she is here for you, for you, for you. She's here. It was not an easy birth by all accounts. A few false starts, they tell me. After I was synthesized, I was respectable for a while. And then, for a long period, I wasn't. Chinaman, sex and white girls were giving me a bad name, but they had nothing to do with me. After that, and for quite some time, I could only help a few jazz musicians, bohemians and the like. I was super cool, but you see, I'm the democratic kind of girl. And my big break came with the Vietnam War when I could help the man and the woman in the street. So it takes a war for the man to find the golden triangle next door. <laughs> the CIA, God bless them, they were flying me out for processing on their own planes, Air America. Of course they knew Lucky, Lucky Luciano in the old days. So 
the connection was in place to fight the evils of communism, a local guy, the general in Saigon, said, you need money. And there was the golden triangle on the doorstep. So pals of Lucky were in business because winner or loser, you always need a connection. Then it was the United States and Europe. And I was available like never before. The black guys in the gathers over there, they were lapping me up. Of course they did, yeah, man. And the man made sure they were lapping me up and stay chilled. Time, 20, 32 hours, 8,000 feet. Identity of pedestrian unconfirmed. Targets, abrupt direction change easterly. Coordinate now, HZZ8. Speed! Then they fucked it up. Vietnam's over, and the Allies that needed the money, they were out on their ears, not worth jack shit. So, slowly, slowly, I was costing too much. Golden triangles far, far away, but not to worry. It's kicking off in Afghanistan, and the Shah of Iran's entourage was next door. So when their number's up, 79 around that time, I was the asset they took with them. It never really stopped in Afghanistan. War. Things were a bit iffy with the mad mullahs. So, but what with the war, USSR down the drain, and now, with all the globalization business, I'm going from strength to strength, and I'm glad I can be so available. Yeah, available to take away the pain, the strain, the boredom in the ghetto, in the small town, most of all, the boredom. Don't be bored. Be cool. You're entitled, calm, instant calm, yes, entitled. So when I hear the no-sayers uh, spreading their negativity all over the world, when I hear them talk of self-harm, I do not know, at first, I do not know whether to laugh or to cry. But then, then I get very angry. Harm, students, harm. Yes, there's plenty of harm in the world. There's harm everywhere. And as for the self, what a childish notion. The Jesuits, who used me mercilessly in the Americas, anything the natives did that they didn't like, it was my fault. What a joke that is, but it's on record that I condemn those natives with their hallucinogenic leaves, nasty, dangerous things. Who wants alternative worlds? It's this world we live in. Who wants visions? No, we want comfort in this world. But I digress. And contrary to what you may have heard, I have no interest in your selves or your souls, as they are called. I have no interest. You are here to pay your fees and learn. Listen and learn. You are learning how to live in the world as it is, in which there is no room for dividends. Dividence is a luxury. You're either part of the problem or you're part of the solution. There's no room for saying no. If comfort is there, take it. Take it. You're entitled. I say don't delay. Take it now. These days, I'm worth 50 billion US. 
they tell me, 50 billion worldwide. And the new lot of mullahs, ISIS, know what side their bread's buttered. Their cut is 1 billion US for transport deals. See, like I said, I'm there for winners too. You winners who may think that losers are getting agitated are worried. Bad losers are saying the game was fixed. Seriously, uncool people, addicted to trouble. But you see, the answer is at hand. Like in that black power time, those panthers. Chill them out, I said to the man. Keep them quiet. Same kind of thing some years later in the Basque land. Everyone agitated. So I said to the security down in Madrid, I think I can be of help here. And you know, it's always good when you're of use. Now and then. So they got some results, them and the arms dealer. Boy, was I available. And now, with that icy sponge in on it, boy, I am, I am available. Targets now in. Coordinate HZZ13, pedestrian density low. Proximate pedestrian identity still unconfirmed. Domestic law, international law, RAF red. Yes, you hear that? You listening? Heroin has made herself available to you. With no regard for color or creed, young or old, winner or loser, through the vicissitudes of the farmer, the persecution of the processes, the obstacles to the smuggler, she is miraculously, through all these problems, made herself available. And therefore, according to the NOSAT of the world, a crime. And now, justify this, they've embarked on a new smear campaign. Before it was addiction, now it's HIV, HIV, crisis, epidemic, Russia, Ukraine, Greece, AIDS, crisis, epidemic, crisis, crisis, crisis. A smear. When I am heroin, we say, chase the dragon. Chase the dragon. Needles. It's a very low class. Is it heroin's fault if the needle is still in use and shared? Cheapskates. Well, this doesn't stop the no-sayers using it as a beat to a stick to beat the people who, who they want to deprive the deprived. The no-sayers aim to deprive the deprived. And they speak only of overdose and death, as if we were all children, as if all people were children. Is it heroin's fault if no care is taken with her purity? Is it heroin's fault if no care is taken with her dosage? Just because one is a loser does not mean that you lose your adulthood your right to choose just because Lady Fortune has spun the wheel against you. No. They are entitled to choose their own dosage, that which makes them comfortable. So I say in the face of this campaign of negativity and disinformation, I say, say no to negativity. No to visions, no to alternatives, yes to comfort. Above all, comfort in this life. 
comfort for all, regardless of background. Choose wisely. Choose heroin. Heroin, the heroin. Coordinate H Z Z one eight. Possible pedestrian and targets heading due east. Permission to strike. Fuck the guidelines. Where there is pain, let there be ease. Where there is anxiety, let there be calm. Where there are casualties, let there be relief. Say no to suffering, no to pain. Words. Yes to this world, no to suffering in this world. Let go. Let go of your anxiety. Let go of your fear. Dare to choose. Do it now. Right now. Even losers can be cool. Okay, class dismissed. Uh, you pay your fees in advance for the next lesson. There will be no exemptions. Strike completed. Successful mission. Intensity. Clean kill. Wipe out. Mission completed. Go, go, go. Spread the word. Call in Crystal. Results guaranteed with Crystal. Results, results guaranteed. Mission impossible. Ooh, fuck that. All sorted. On a mission, busy schedule, people to meet. Ladies and gentlemen, Crystal, dear Whoa. students, Crystal, Fuck Crystal it. met the yeah. real live wire. Oh. On a mission, people to meet. Spread the word, spread the word. Uppers are good for you. How Uppers older. are good for you. Appointments, people boring. to meet, things to do. Puh. Best results with Crystal. I am Crystal. I am the sir, I'm the I'm the surgeon jiving in the ambulance. That's it. Crystal, I should, Crystal, I should need you tomorrow for, oh, yeah, for, yeah. for the lesson tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, tomorrow, I tomorrow. I should praise you to the skies, I of course. You don't call me. Of course, dear Crystal, oh. I should praise you to the skies. Tomorrow, tomorrow, give me a time, give me a break, give me a break. Tomorrow, thank you. Tomorrow, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. All sorted, all sorted. Fuck, fuck, fuck the guidelines, oh yeah. yeah. Oh. Defend the right, defend the right, the right to be free. We shall not flag our tail, we shall go to the end. Run, rabbit, run. Run, 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 rabbit. Whoa, fuck the guidelines, yes. Thank you, Mark, Sam. You're a beautiful